evolution of computers history of computers in early days when our ancestor used to reside in cave the counting was a problem still it is stated becoming difficult when they started using stone to count their animals or the possession they never knew that this day will lead to a computer of today early people started following a set of procedure to perform calculation with these stones which later led to creation of a digital counting device this was the predecessor of the first calculating device invented and was known as abacus the abacus abacus is known to be the first mechanical calculating device invented about 5000 years ago by the chinese it was used to perform addition and subtraction easily and speedily abacus is made up of wooden frame in which rods were fitted across with round beads sliding on the rod it is dividing into two parts called heaven and earth heaven was the upper part and earth was the lower one napier's bones as necessity demanded scientists started inventing better calculating devices in this process john napier of scotland invented a calculating device in the year 1617 called the napier's bones in the device napier's used the bone rods for the purpose of counting where some number is printed on these rods using these rods one can do addition subtraction multiplication and division easily pascal's calculator in the year 1642 blaise pascal a french scientist invented an adding machine called pascal's calculator which represents the position of digit with the help of gears in it leibniz calculator in the year 1671 a german mathematician gottfried wilhelm von leibniz modified the pascal calculator and he developed a machine which could perform various calculations based on multiplication and division as well analytical engine In the year 1833 a scientist from England known as Charles Babbage proposed the idea of a mechanical general purpose computer this device was called analytical engine and it is widely accepted as the first design of a mechanical computer it includes many features which are used in today's computer language this was more useful and versatile than the difference engine made by babbage generations of computers the development in the field of computers have been divided into generations with every passing generation computers got better faster and smaller first generation computers 1940 to 1956 The first generation computers had vacuum tubes valves as the main electronic component. The first general purpose programmable electronic computer was the Electronic Numerical Integrator and Computer ENIAC built by J Presper Eckert and John V Mockley at the University of Pennsylvania. Second generation computers 1956 to 1963 the second generation computers had transistors as their main electronic component transistors were very small in size and faster in speed as compared to vacuum tubes during second generation many high level programming languages were introduced including fortran in 1956 algol in 1958 and cobol in 1959 third generation computers 1964 to 1971 the third generation computers replaced transistors with ic's integrated circuits 
the size of third generation computers was so small that they could be easily placed on a small table. These computers were smaller in size, less expensive and very fast in speed. They were more reliable and accurate than the previous generation computers. Fourth generation computers 1971 to present day The fourth generation of computer systems used large scale integration LSI 1000 devices per chip and very large scale integration VLSI 1 lakh devices per chip in the construction of computing elements these computers were cheaper faster more accurate and reliable than any of the generation of computers before they can be easily placed and transported because of their small size and weight this also includes handheld devices such as tablets smartphones etc they require a very small sized ics and microprocessors fifth generation computers present and future fifth generation computers are totally based on artificial intelligence these computers have the capability of logical thinking as humans and learning from past experiences characteristics of computers speed computers perform calculations or any other task at a very fast speed the speed of the computer is measured in gigahertz many tasks can be done simultaneously and within the fraction of a second accuracy computers are accurate in performing any task the modern computers are so accurate that they not only detect errors but can also correct them easily storage capacity computers have a large storage capacity which is called their memory it has the ability to store very huge amount of data and information that can be used later the computer stores data in two ways temporary memory or random access memory it stores the data only till the computer is on all data and information stored in this memory is lost once the computer is switched off permanent memory it stores the data in the rom hard disk or on a secondary storage device cd rom pen drive etc permanently any data or information stored is not lost even when the power is switched off it can be recalled for future use automation once appropriate instructions are given a computer will carry out the task till its completion diligence computers never get tired like humans it is a machine performing millions of calculations and several tasks simultaneously with accuracy consistent and constant speed versatility computer performs many types of operations related to various fields related softwares are available for specific tasks it can be used to perform a variety of jobs with perfection the same computer can be used to type letters play a movie listen to songs surfing the internet perform calculations etc limitations of a computer it is a dump machine computers cannot do anything on its own if no command is given computer works only when the electricity is available 